Welcome back to Ace Movie Channel. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe our channel and ring the bell so you never miss a video. Go ahead and comment down below that more tutorials you'd like to see from us. Today I'm gonna show you how to remove black bars from video with Ace Movie in the following two parts. Part 1. Remove black bars from video with Ace Movie. Step 1. Add media files. First, find the video file with black bars and open Ace Movie, which can support various video formats. As you can see, you can import the video in here three points. Next, add the video to the track. Step 2. Start to remove black bars in the video. When add the video to the track, click the video, and move up to click the crop and zoom button. Next, you will see there is aspect ratio for you to adjust, and you can select 16 to 9. Or you can manually move the frame line to adjust its size and eliminate the black bars. Step 3. Save the edited video. Before you export the video, you may choose to preview the edited video and see whether it meets your expectations. If it is OK, then just click export. In this step, you can reset the video format or quality as you like. Part 2. Remove black bars from video online. In this section, I will introduce the online tools Clidio. If you only need to adjust one video for one time, using it may be easier. Step 1. Upload the file you want to remove black bars. Open the video resizer in any browser. Press the big blued button in the center of the tool's homepage and upload a video file with black bars. Or you can choose a video from Google Drive or Dropbox. Step 2. Remove black bars. When open the file, you will see a menu on the right side. Choose the suitable aspect ratio or manually alter video's width and height. Then click the fill button under the crop options to get rid of the bars. Step 3. Export the video. After the black bars are removed, you can click export to export your video files. If you are happy with your video without black bars, you can click download to save the file. That's it for today's video tutorial. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and ring the bell. Let us know what tutorials you'd like to see next in the comments below. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Yeah.